Good day, everyone. Hey, why are you so dressed up? <laughs> yeah, why are you so dressed up? I thought we were all here to talk about Across the Spider-Verse and Street Fighters. Ah, uh, but there's no time for such nonsense. Nonsense? Do you realize how big both of those things are? Yes, but we can discuss those things at a later time. Have you heard the news? <laughs> about what? Street Fighter 6 selling over 50 million copies just over the weekend? Yeah, or is it about Across the Spider-Verse being the best film in cinema history? No, 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 no. Are you here to talk about your One Piece progress? Apple announced a new exquisite product. Bro. Seriously? Indeed. Check out the trailer. You could experience your favorite stories in unexpected ways or in unbelievable places. You could be at the game without leaving your home. What if you could travel on a National Geographic adventure? Or if your imaginary friends oh boy. Uh -huh. uh -huh. And what if you could become a superhero and seek the answer? Stop. Space. Isn't this Applicious? What? Did this guy just say Applicious? Dude, is this Apple's take on a VR headset? Yeah, how much is this shit anyway? It's only $34.99.99. Thirty-four. What? Oh. And what's wrong with that? Bro, are you serious right now? Don't you have vertigo? No. What did you just take? Oh, these these are these are just apple vitamins. <laughs> Excuse me. Did he just? Yo, tell me you did not just pre-order that. I absolutely didn't. What of it? Yeah. You know, let me just tell you a little something. I myself have been an apple guy, but I don't consider myself an apple guy like you. You see, I had an iPod. I've been an Apple user since the iPod. You remember the iPod? Yeah, the good old days, right? And then eventually I got the iPhone. My first iPhone was the four. But see, the difference between guys like you and guys like me is that I don't go out of my way to make sure that I have whatever the latest and greatest and in innovation that Apple decides to do. You wanna know why? I find it funny how every new device that comes out, it seems to function a little weird after a year wouldn't you say yes. so rather than just try to sheep myself into getting every single new product i wait i wait because it doesn't really matter because i know that there's going to be something new each and every year but the innovation is not really going to back these ridiculous price points but that's not even the issue here you see the real issue is guys like him that no matter what Apple puts out, y'all are gonna just eat at it and buy into it no matter how expensive they are. And the funny part is, is that it's all for what? To flex, right? Damn. Well, guess what? Have fun flexing your Vision Pro before, guess, guess ready, 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 ready? Innovation, right? The Vision Pro. Pro 2, <laughs> I'm not done yet, the Vision Pro Max, okay? Because 3,500 now, all right? But I won't be surprised if you're gonna spend five grand or 10 grand on whatever Apple decides what innovation is. Because at the end of the day, no matter what they do, folks like you are just gonna keep buying this no matter how innovative or not these things are. So have fun flexing in your own home to yourself away from everyone else because I'm cool with my iPhone 12. Yeah. Dummy. Yeah. So yeah, have fun with your new Vision Pro or whatever the hell it'll be called by the time it comes out next year <laughs> to yourself inside your home, wherever the hell you live and have fun flexing it online, I guess, because you know, I'm sure you're not going to walk around with it, right? Hmm.